Intermittent fasting and constipation. What's the deal? Intermittent fasting, it's all the rage these days and for good reason. This powerful eating pattern offers a plethora of health benefits from weight management to improved insulin sensitivity. But let's be real folks, like any lifestyle change, intermittent fasting can come with a few bumps in the road. One common concern, you guessed it, constipation. Understanding the basics. Intermittent fasting 101. Before we dive into the nitty gritty of constipation, let's make sure we're all on the same page about intermittent fasting. In a nutshell, it's not about you eat, but you eat. It involves cycling between periods of eating and fasting, which can range from a few hours to a whole day or more. The gut check, why constipation happens during intermittent fasting. Now let's address the elephant in the room, or should we say the, uh, in the bathroom. Constipation during intermittent fasting can occur for a few reasons. Reduced food intake. When you eat less often, your body produces less waste. This can lead to less frequent bowel movements. Dehydration fasting or restricting food intake can sometimes lead to dehydration, especially if you're not mindful of your fluid intake. Dehydration is a common culprit behind constipation. Electrolyte imbalances. Electrolytes play a crucial role in regulating muscle contractions, including those in your gut. Fasting can disrupt electrolyte balance, potentially slowing things down in the digestive department. Another factor to consider is dietary fiber. When you fast, you might not be consuming enough fiber-rich foods like fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. Fiber is essential for adding bulk to your stool and promoting regular bowel movements. Without it, constipation can become a real issue. Physical activity also plays a significant role. Regular exercise helps stimulate intestinal contractions, aiding in the movement of waste through your digestive system. A sedentary lifestyle, which can sometimes accompany fasting periods, may contribute to sluggish digestion and constipation. To combat constipation during intermittent fasting, consider incorporating natural remedies like herbal teas, which can help soothe the digestive tract and promote bowel movements. Stress management is another crucial aspect. High stress levels can negatively impact your digestive health, so practices like mindfulness and meditation can be beneficial. Planning your meals to include a balance of nutrients, staying hydrated, and maintaining an active lifestyle can all help mitigate the risk of constipation while fasting. If constipation persists, it's always a good idea to consult with a healthcare professional to rule out any underlying conditions and get personalized advice. By understanding these factors and taking proactive steps, you can enjoy the benefits of intermittent fasting without the discomfort of constipation. Remember, a healthy gut is key to overall well-being. Subscribe for more health tips and stay informed on how to keep your digestive system in top shape. Thanks for watching. Stay regular. Top tips to prevent constipation while fasting. Don't worry my friends, constipation during intermittent fasting is usually temporary and preventable. With a few mindful adjustments, you can keep your digestive system running smoothly. Constipation during intermittent fasting is usually temporary and preventable. It's all about making the right choices and listening to your body. Here are a few tried and true tips to keep things moving and grooving. Hydrate like a champ water is your best friend especially when you're fasting. Staying hydrated is crucial for maintaining regular bowel movements. Water is your best friend especially when you're fasting. Aim to drink plenty of water throughout the day, even during your fasting window. This helps to keep your digestive system lubricated and functioning properly. Aim to drink plenty of water throughout the day, even during your fasting window. Fiber is your ally. Fiber adds bulk to your stool, making it easier to pass. Incorporate a variety of fiber-rich foods into your diet. Fiber adds bulk to your stool, making it easier to pass. Load up on fiber-rich foods like vegetables, fruits, and whole grains during your eating windows. These foods not only help with digestion but also keep you feeling full and satisfied. Load up on fiber-rich foods like vegetables, fruits, and whole grains during your eating windows. Electrolyte Boost Replenishing electrolytes is crucial, especially during longer fasts. Electrolytes help maintain fluid balance and support muscle function, including the muscles in your digestive tract. Replenishing electrolytes is crucial, especially during longer fasts. Consider adding a pinch of Himalayan salt to your water or sipping on bone broth. These can provide essential minerals like sodium, potassium, and magnesium. Consider adding a pinch of Himalayan salt to your water or sipping on bone broth. Bone broth is not only soothing but also packed with nutrients that support gut health. Remember, consistency is key. Stick to these tips and you'll find it easier to stay regular while fasting. Happy fasting! Hydration is key, the power of water during fasting. Let's talk more about hydration, shall we? 
Water is essential for every cell in our body. It helps in maintaining the balance of bodily fluids, which is crucial when you're fasting. When you're fasting your body isn't getting its usual dose of fluids from food. This can lead to dehydration which as we know can contribute to constipation. Dehydration can also cause headaches, dizziness and fatigue. Timing is everything. Don't wait until you're thirsty to drink water. Sip on it consistently throughout the day, even during your fasting window. It's important to listen to your body and recognize the signs of dehydration early. Jazz it up, plain water not your jam. Try infusing it with fruits, veggies or herbs for a refreshing twist. Cucumber, lemon and mint are excellent choices. You can also try adding berries, oranges or even a splash of apple cider vinegar for a different flavor. Infused water not only tastes great but also adds a hint of vitamins and minerals to your hydration routine. So next time you're fasting, remember to keep that water bottle handy and stay hydrated. Fiber up your gut's best friend. Fiber, oh glorious fiber. It's the unsung hero of digestive health, adding bulk to your stool and promoting regularity. Nature's bounty embrace whole, unprocessed foods like fruits, vegetables, legumes, and whole grains. These fiber powerhouses will keep things moving along swimmingly. Gradual increase, don't go overboard with fiber all at once. Increase your intake gradually to avoid any digestive discomfort. Electrolytes, the unsung heroes of fasting. Electrolytes often take a backseat in the nutrition world but they're essential for maintaining proper bodily functions including digestion. Sodium, potassium, magnesium, these mighty minerals play a crucial role in muscle function and hydration. Sources. Replenish your electrolytes with foods like avocados, leafy greens, nuts, and seeds. You can also opt for electrolyte supplements or add a pinch of salt to your water. Movement and mindfulness. Boost your digestive health. Exercise and stress management aren't just good for your mind and body, they're great for your gut too. Get moving. Regular physical activity, even a brisk walk, can stimulate bowel movements and promote regularity. Stress less. Chronic stress can wreak havoc on your digestive system. Engage in stress-reducing activities like yoga, meditation, or spending time in nature. Common fasting mistakes and how to avoid them. Intermittent fasting is generally safe for most people, but a few common mistakes can sabotage your efforts and lead to digestive woes. Let's address these blunders head on, not drinking enough water. We've said it before and we'll say it again. Hydration is key, skimping on fiber. Don't underestimate the power of fiber. Make it a staple in your diet during your eating windows. Ignoring electrolytes. Electrolyte imbalances can lead to constipation and other unpleasant side effects. Listen to your body, it speaks volumes. Your body is incredibly intelligent and knows its limits. Pay attention to any signals it's sending you, especially when it comes to your digestion. Discomfort? Slow down. If you experience any discomfort or digestive issues while fasting, don't hesitate to break your fast and consult with your healthcare provider. Gradual adjustments. Ease into intermittent fasting gradually, starting with shorter fasting windows and gradually increasing the duration as your body adjusts. Your fasting journey. A marathon, not a sprint. Embarking on a new lifestyle change like intermittent fasting is a journey my friends, not a race. Be patient with yourself, listen to your body's cues, and remember that consistency is key. So, tell me, what strategies will you implement to prevent constipation during your intermittent fasting journey?